we'll find the regression equation for neck sizes versed on the wrist size. So in this example, we're using the wrist size as the independent variable x, and we're using the neck size as the dependent variable y. I'll simply enter a blank cell on my document, and I'll type in slope. I'll go to the next adjacent cell, I'll go up to the function, I'll hit equal, slope, I'll put in a begin parenthesis, and the parameters for the slope function are the known y's, comma, the known x's, so for my known y values, I'll simply highlight all of my y values, I'll insert a comma, next I'll highlight all of my known x's, so I'll highlight all of the risk values. I'll end my function with a parenthesis and I'll hit enter. And we have a slope of 2.13. Next we'll find the intercept. So I'll enter a free cell in my workbook. I'll type in intercept. I'll go to an adjacent blank cell. I'll go up to the function area and I'll hit equal intercept. I'll now place a begin parentheses and my parameters are the same, the known y's and the known x's. So I'll highlight all my known y's, comma, we'll highlight all the known x's, we'll end with the parentheses, and we have our slope and y-intercept. Therefore our regression equation is the next size is equal to the slope which is 2.13269 times x and x will be our wrist size plus the y-intercept which is 2.93275